Hey, Samika, thank you. Good morning to all of you. Good morning to my news team. It's nice to be back with all of you. And of course, talking about something that is very important, I have had the COVID test, the nasal swab. It's not something that's comfortable. So this, as you said, Samika, could be a game changer because it's saying not only would it be cheaper, but it would also be faster, getting results in as little as under three hours. So this new saliva-based screening test could be a major breakthrough in the fight to flatten the curve. Now, it could cost as little as $10 per test. You know, and some of these nasal swab tests have traditionally been upwards of $150, so a big decrease there. Now, the FDA has granted emergency use of these tests being developed by Yale's School of Public Health. The method skips pulling out the virus's genetic material, and that's what costs more and takes more time. So instead, the saliva is broken down with an enzyme that applies heat, and this is something Yale professionals are working on. The MBA actually helped fund the development for the test and even used it to test for asymptomatic carriers as they continue their season. So of course the concern for some is if this test could be as efficient as the navel, nasal swab and those researchers at Yale saying really they believe that it can be. So as I said, the FDA has granted the emergency use of this type of testing for the coronavirus. Now coming up at 630, we're going to discuss when researchers think that it could be readily available for everyone. So we'll have more details coming up for you then. We'll see you then.